All right, we are at uh, 17.6, I believe it is, standing waves in air columns. And before I get to the PowerPoint, I'm going to do a little uh, demonstration uh, where I'm just blowing across this, uh, this straw. I should turn my thing so you can see what I'm doing. And you can see that the, the frequency is changing. Why is the frequency changing? Because as I lengthen this, this uh, uh, column, uh, or the air in this column, it, uh, it chooses a lower frequency. It resonates at the lowest frequency. I'll do it once again. This is like a pan pipe. I know there used to be like a Colombian uh, band that used to play all these pan pipes down at the uh, uh, the River Center Mall, uh, Colombian, Peruvian. I may have the country wrong, but they were, uh, you know, they're very enjoyable to listen to. And they so they had a set of pan pipes with different ones at different lengths. And that's what we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about standing waves in air columns. This is the information that. Uh, goes along with the uh, uh, the experiment that we, uh, the air column resonance experiment. And they're showing you here a pipe organ, a church pipe, pipe organ. I, uh, my wife's cousin is a pastor at uh, uh, Laurel Heights Methodist Church and we go and visit him every once in a while. They have this beautiful, beautiful uh, pipe organ there um, and uh, you can see that the the pipes on the pipe organ have different lengths and they're at different lengths to resonate um, at different frequencies and so here, here we go it, um, in a pipe open at both ends the ends are displacement antinodes and pressure nodes um, uh, the harmonic series contains all ingredients, all, I'm sorry, all integer multiples of the fundamental. So at the end of a, both pipes open, the, the, the molecules are free to, um, free to, to move. And uh, so the displacement wave is, has antinodes. The pressure nodes has, uh, uh, I mean, the pressure wave has nodes at the ends, but an antinode in the middle. Um, we'll concern ourselves more, not, not so much with the pressure nodes, but with the uh, displacement wave. And you can see that the, you can get, uh, it's kind of like the opposite of a guitar string or the, where we had a string anchored between two points. We had nodes at the end because they were anchored, they're not free to move, and the antinode in the middle. Here we have the antinodes at the ends and the nodes in, in, in the middle for the first harmonic. The second harmonic, uh, again, it's open at the end and it has, uh, uh, this one has three antinodes. And here, the third harmonic, it has three nodes, but four antinodes. Uh, so the, uh, in a pipe, open at both ends, the natural frequency of, frequencies of oscillation form a harmonic series that includes all integral multiples of the fundamental frequency. Uh, so the F sub one would be V over two L. Um, uh, F sub two would be N, o, N times V over two L would be V over L. And F sub three would be uh, uh, three halves V over L and so forth. Um, now, if it, a pipe is closed at one end, you can see that the um, uh, where it's closed at one end, the molecules aren't free to move at that closed end. So there's going to be a, a node. They're free to move at the open end. So here you're going to have an antinode at the end, but a node at the uh, closed end. In the pipe closed at one end, the open end is a displacement antinode and a pressure node. The closed end is a displacement node and a pressure antinode. The harmonic series contains 
um, odd multiples of the fundamental. So in this first harmonic, you're only looking at a quarter wave of the, the, the total uh, wavelength. Um, the, uh, that's just a quarter of a wave. In the uh, third harmonic, it's three quarters of a wave. Um, in the fifth harmonic, it's, it's uh, um, uh, five, five quarters of a wave. Uh, so, so you can see how they're produced. And we're actually going to, uh, this is what is done in the air column resonance uh, experiment. In the pipe closed at one end, the natural frequencies of oscillation form a harmonic series that includes only odd integral multiples of the fundamental frequency. Um, so the uh, f, f of m, f sub m is equal to m times the velocity over uh, 4L, where m is equal to 1, 3, 5, or f of n is equal to 2n minus 1 times v. Um, the velocity over 4L, where n is equal to 1, 2, and 3. Uh, so let's see. Um, here the, uh, they're showing you, uh, did I miss one? Oh, there's a, uh, I have one of a, a picture of a, a symphony. Um, and I don't know what happened to that, that picture here. We have the, uh, the band musical in instruments based on air col on air columns are generally excited by resonance. The air collar air column presented with sound wave with many frequencies. Um, yeah, it's just showing you all the the little different uh, uh, air uh, woodwind instruments that that uh, produce sounds. Um, okay, a pipe open at both ends. Uh, resonates at a fundamental frequency, um, F open. When one end is covered and the pipe is again made to resonate, the fundamental frequency is F closed. Which of the following expressions describes how these two resonant frequencies compare? Well, if the uh, um, F closed is a quarter wavelength um, and F open is a half wavelength, we'll see that the F close is equal to one half of the F open. Um, we know that F close isn't equal to F open. Uh, so this is the, just B, B is the answer. Uh, so the um, Balboa Park in San Diego has an outdoor organ. When the air temperature increases, the fundamental frequency of one, one of the organ pipes, now remember the uh, speed of sound increases as the uh, air temperature increases. If the speed of sound increases, let's find the, um, uh, if the, look at that, if the velocities in the, the velocities in the numerator, so the, uh, the, the speed of sound goes up with temperature, then the frequency goes up with temperature. Let's go back to the question. Um, when the air temperature increases, the fundamental frequency of one of the uh, organ pipes goes up. Um, if the air temperature increases, the frequency increases. Okay. Uh, and next, we're going to do beats.